What's going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. In this one, we're going to go over the new virus mainframe vortex event. I have early gameplay footage of the brand new operator bundles, which is the mainframe operator skin. Also got an early showcasing of what the rewards are going to be and the animated binary morality camo and all the details are covered in today's video along with some other news. So if you find the video helpful or informative, don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button. A quick reminder, if you're interested in more free rewards, I did make a video compiling all the different free types of rewards that you're able to get from season three, which include op operator bundles, different weapon blueprint packs, and a lot of camos and other types of rewards. So I'll have the link for that down in the description. A huge shout out to Matt Sweeting for becoming a brand new member of the channel. If you would like to become a member yourself and get access to exclusive perks and support the channel, I'll have the link for that down in the description. Anyways, let's go ahead. Let's jump into it. Before we talk about the main event itself, there is a smaller one that actually goes live today. For those of you guys who are on PlayStation, Double XP is now live for the next 24 hours. But then for everyone else, so if you're on PC or Xbox, including PlayStation, station as well you will have double xp to pretty much everything weapon battle pass and regular and that's going to be going live tomorrow at 10 a.m pacific standard time lasting until the weekend and i believe that usually ends around monday 10 a.m pacific standard time unfortunately this is not going to help you with the virus mainframe xp event regardless this is a good event for the weekend if you want to level up your weapons or just get to that maximum level cap to unlock that free blueprint we did also receive a brand new playlist update today and that brought in high trip resurgence in quads rebirth rank play in Trios, Plunder in Quads of Years Extend, Battle Royale in Solos, Duos, Trios, and Quads, and Resurgent in Solos, Duos, and Quads with Trios in the map rotation. That's pretty much the only difference this week is the Trios map rotation. Anyways, other than that, now we jump into the actual new content we're getting from this new Vortex LTM event. This will be going live on the 24th of April. This will be bringing in three brand new items. The first one is the Virus Mainframe Operator Bundle, which I'll showcase early gameplay of later in the video. We also have a brand new XP event that will come in with many rewards, including an animated camo and then the last thing is a brand new playlist and they're doing it a little differently this time it says the pre-natural map variants airborne satan's quarry skid grow spore yard and tetanus return in a special limited time playlist coming later in season three the familiar vortex mosh pit will be available along with a new arcade mode with a number of redacted gameplay modifiers to add yet more variety to your game my guess is they're probably going to end up adding things like the boy superpowers that we saw multiple times that were added we had that multiplayer version we also have the high trip resurgence which comes in with different effects where you have super speed fast reloading no fall damage those types of effects and superpowers are probably going to end up coming into the multiplayer version with this brand new playlist update so not only do you get these maps but there's also going to be more surprises that's not going to make it the standard vortex so for those of you guys who are bored of the same exact maps coming back over and over for every vortex we've had this season they're going to change up the playlist and as they mentioned here they're going to introduce new modifiers and new special abilities in terms of arcade something told me that maybe just like we have the parkour and multiplayer for the high trip maybe they'll have a different variant for this in vortex that's also something that could potentially end up happening but i do hope they do well with this ltm and it's a little bit different than some of the ones that we saw last season just a reminder because this event is going to be coming in this upcoming wednesday that means the high trip the 420 event the blaze up rewards they're all going to be going away it is your last chance this upcoming weekend to get everything that you are missing if you need a guide i already made one i'll have the link down in the description anyways let's talk about the brand new virus mainframe operator skin that's going to be coming in with this event known as the virus ultra skin tracer pack this is going to be coming in for ghost called the bacillus operator it is an ultra animated skin on top of that this is going to be costing 2400 cod points it's expected to arrive around the event time so around the 24th it should be available in the store along with that there's going to be two different weapon blueprints the first one is called the viral ignition which is for the sva 545 it has a tracer impact called the trojan tracers and a death effect called the malware dismemberment and here's early gameplay footage of what that weapon blueprint looks like following that you also get a second weapon blueprint and this one is for the holger 26 called the pathogen it also comes along with the same exact tracers and the malware dismemberment the rest of the bundle will contain a zombie acquisition which is a flawless ethereum crystal you get a large decal called the death tally there's also a brand new weapon sticker called the vile vile and then you also get a weapon charm called the infectious and the last thing is a battle pass token Token tier skip if you use this bundle and you equip it during the event you will get an extra xp boost anyways let's go ahead and go over the different rewards and the early gameplay showcasing of them because this is an xp event you simply just need to play the game multiplayer warzone or zombies generate xp and you will get these rewards the first one is available at 9500 xp that will unlock you this new weapon sticker called the loadout the next reward is going to be at 21500 xp and that will be a one hour double weapon xp token the next reward is at 36500 
550 XP. That will be a large decal called the point and click. The next reward is going to be 55,600 XP, a one hour double battle pass XP token. The next reward is at 79,500 XP called the pop up pop off emblem. The next reward is at 109,700 XP called the going viral large decal. Following that, you have the Got Hacked Calling Card, which is available at 147,700 XP. The next reward is going to be a Battle Pass Token Tier Skip, which is going to be at 195,600 XP. You then have the Block Fly Charm, which is unlocked at 255,950 XP. We jump into the Weapon Sticker called the Sneaking In at 332,000 XP. Then we have this new error code calling card, which is going to be the second last reward unlocked at 427,800 XP, which actually looks pretty sick. It's not animated, unfortunately. And then the last reward that you unlock, which is at around 548,500 XP, is the binary morality camo. The XP goal could potentially change, but for this event being around a week long, it should be around the 550k XP mark. But this is the binary morality camo that you'll be able to unlock upon completing this entire event. I feel like this is a really good camo reward. It's fully animated. It actually looks pretty sick. Compared to some of the other camos that are available during season three, this is probably one of the best ones. But what are your thoughts and opinions on this? Is this a camo that you plan on rocking? It will be universal for all MW2 and MW3 weapons and will be under the event tab when available the only tip that i can give you guys in terms of finishing this challenge really fast is to play longer modes if you play modes like warzone resurgence where you can always respawn come back to life meaning that you'll last a little bit longer in the games every loot cache you open up every elimination you get every time you ping something and your squad lands together those are all free ways that you can get xp through warzone another thing is to play the objective and objective based modes for those of you guys who prefer multiplayer play something like hardpoint domination where you would capture the flag and capture objectives and and while you're defending them, you're also getting eliminations, assists. You can always go in there with decoy grenades if you're trying to level up weapons. That's also considered a long base mode that you can play. But my recommendation would always be Warzone because of, as I mentioned, the resurgence. And you can always keep coming back. And the games could last a lot longer. By one game, you probably could end up getting three of those rewards. Anyways, the very last topic that I want to go over is it looks like Activision Blizzard is doing a very big giveaway, a massive sweepstakes. And this is something I just wanted to let you guys know about in case you're interested in entering. So it says right here ghost approves our call of duty able gamers prizes include a tour of treyarch studios a custom ghost mask a decked out gaming chair call of duty posters and much more and you can donate for a chance to win they ended up putting a little table for the amount of entries you put in ten dollars you get 10 entries and it really depends how much you want to donate but if you don't want to there's actually a free way that you can enter and that is to print out a free entry form available on their website which i'll also have linked down in the description you follow the instructions i believe you'll need to print that out and then you mail it over to their address and then that's how you'll be able to do it so you'll need to scroll down on this website in order to check all the details for that but if you are interested in something like this i'll have that available for you guys but that's pretty much all that i got in this one thank you guys for tuning in if you found the video helpful or informative don't forget to hit that like and subscribe button let me know what else you guys want to see here on the channel but it's been your boy Trizzo, and i'll see you guys again peace <laughs>